Wynn Paris, PhD, fitness doctor of philosophy, the father of fitness medicine. I'm not an MD, but did invent fitness medicine. In fact, um, I invented it at our first Jack Lane Fitness Center. There's Jack and me at the opening of the club in, um, I think, 1965. So that's where we invented fitness medicine. We actually invented the, um, the name in the mineral whirlpool at Myriad Hot Springs. It just came to me from a, a lifetime in fitness and therapy. And fitness medicine popped in and I got really excited. By the way, this is a picture of me in 1952 at 20 years of age. So all the exercises is an important part of the therapy. I think that now it's therapeutic exercise or medical exercise is the most important part of physical therapy. And we're going to talk to you today about your back, but a little other background we have is a physical therapy degree from University of Southern California. Phi Epsilon Kappa Scholastic Society from UCLA in education and Phi Delta Kappa which is a Scholastic Society at UCLA also. Then the paper that I wrote at UCLA the research project started off like this. Ever since human beings assumed the upright position they were destined to have low back pain. I'll repeat that again. Ever since human beings assumed the upright position, they were destined to have low back pain. Now here's the human spine, and that's the pelvis. And when they were walking all fours, according to the theory, the pelvis was flat. But as they assumed the upright position, they started getting an arch in the back, and that arch in the lower back, the five lumbar vertebrae, is what causes pain many times down the leg. So there it is. Now with the MDs and the orthopedic doctors, with my company Physical Physicians Physical Therapy, they just said get them better because it's very specialized and the doctors don't specialize in this. And what you have to do is stretch the lumbar muscles, the erector spina, you, you do it like this. This is very conservative, I wouldn't show it to you over the TV. You breathe out, you hold it, and you breathe, breathe out again. That stretches the lumbar muscles. Then the other exercise you have to do is for your lower belly, because as the belly gets big, it pulls on your back. So see, it's not a matter of a pill usually, it's a, a matter of um, kinesiology, the movement of the body, anatomy, the structure of the body, even physiology, the function of the body. So, 60 billion a year is what Americans used to spend on the low back. It's probably over 100 billion a year. And um, I'm preparing a DVD for you that will explain all of this and the DVD will only cost $19.95 right now $19.95 so I suggest you get in touch with PayPal as soon as possible and reserve your DVD and of course there will be other exercises also be an exercise for your hamstrings and my professor at UCLA, Dr. Valerie Hunt, showed her kinesiology class a great exercise for the hamstrings. Total muscular balance. By the way, I'm dedicating this to Packy McFarland, a brilliant writer, producer in TV, but more important, a great human being. It's been a great help to me. And Packy will probably work on the DVD so that you get a really great one. 
So the low back, your belly, your back, your hamstrings, all these muscles are connected. And that's why just a painkiller is usually not enough. But it's up to your MD or the big doctor to make the diagnosis. There's two parts of medicine. One is diagnosing and the other is the prescription. And we leave it up to your doctor to do the diagnosing prescription. But many times it's just a part of muscular imbalance and getting a big belly. So get in touch with PayPal as soon as possible. PayPal as soon as possible to reserve your DVD. Remember, your body is your temple of God. Take care of your body, your body will take care of you. Neglect your body, and your life will be through. That's from the book of, of spiritual poetry I wrote, Win With God Poetry. In fact, I think I'll just repeat another poem right now, spontaneously. Win, yea, win, and whatever you do. Win, yea, win, it's the measure of you. Win, yea, win, you can do it, I know. Just keep your eye on God's heavenly glow. Thank you.